If you're ready to do math today and you have your coffee ready, join me in the simultaneous sip. The question we're working on today is, find the value of h for which the following vectors are linearly dependent. And the vectors are 1, minus 1, 4, 3, minus 5, 7, and minus 1, 5, h. So in order for these vectors to be linearly dependent, we just want to show that the matrix formed by grouping all the vectors together has a free variable. Okay, and so we're going to figure out which value of h allows us to have a free variable. So let's start row reducing until we get to row echelon form. Here we took the one in the first row to be our pivot and eliminated everything below it. And now we'll clean up the second row just to make it easier on the algebra. And we can eliminate the negative five in row three using the one in row two. As we'll see, that will put an h minus six as the only term in the bottom row. And so if we want there to be a free variable corresponding to x3, we need h minus six to equal zero. That is h equals six. Make sure to subscribe for more Coffee and Math with Dr. Wesselcouch. Don't text and drive. Bye-bye.